I am super late, I start working in two minutes. So I'll work for three hours, Brian will go and get breakfast for us. Yeah, I'm just having like three lessons that I really can't postpone. People have exams and presentations. I'll see you well, later. I'm gonna go in 20 minutes or something. Okay. I'm sorry, that was a bad intro. I just wanted to say that I would have to teach for three hours and that Brian would go get breakfast. You know how much I love breakfast at the hotel, right? Well, with coronavirus, we couldn't have our buffet and they gave us a banana muffin and an apple. Disappointing. But enough with the complaining. Now let's start this vlog with some good vibes. I'm ready and Muff Jim, Brian said he's coming because we'll climb together, we'll hike together. It's not, it's, it's a hike. It will be 21 degrees. I have Celsius. a sweater. Celsius. Yes, of course, Celsius. I speak Celsius. And how long should it take? A few hours. A few hours, a few hours. hours. I ended up eating that muffin because I was hungry, but it wasn't the healthiest thing ever. But you got okay. water? No. Should I bring water? I'll use the little camera because I feel like this camera is a little bit uncomfortable for the, this kind of vlog So that's my pocket, I'll see you later Muff Jim came to pick us up at like 10.15 And we saw Denver in the morning, it was very beautiful I love cities, I love these urban vibes I like modern cities I know, I'm from Rome, Rome is everything but a modern city But still, beautiful Anyways, we left Denver Last time in my previous video we went east, we went towards Kansas and that's where Colorado is flat. But as you probably know, Colorado is famous for its mountains and this time we drove to the mountains, so west. We are here, we parked and we're ready to go. It's very beautiful, it's sunny, the weather is amazing, I love it. I saw some other people. They started the, the hike and they have like huge backpacks and they have like the right shoes and the right equipment and here's me. I'm like going to the gym pretty much. I hope it's fine. And here's me. Okay, I know you know, I am not a nature girl, I've told you. But when they said like, let's go for a hike, it's like just a hike. After doing Mount Fuji, because I climbed Mount Fuji and there's a vlog, so true. I thought like, yeah, didn't even think about it twice. I hope it's not too hard. Good. In this vlog, there will be a lot of nature, but Colorado is famous for its nature. So enjoy the sounds, enjoy the music, and enjoy the vlog. I didn't bring much, but I did bring sunscreen. I didn't last long with that little crop top. Now I'm okay. the yellow of these plants, look how beautiful! Anyways, here I started explaining that people say that hiking in Colorado might be a little bit more difficult than hiking in other parts of the world because Colorado is pretty high. Like for example, Denver is called the mile high city because its elevation is already one mile above sea level. So if you go to the mountains, I'll let you do the math. It might be a little more difficult to breathe, but I have no problems to be honest. There are a lot of weird sounds, I have to admit. And I'm like, what kind of animal makes that sound, that noise, like, like a chainsaw? I later found out it was a cricket. Sonia always says she's not a nature girl, but she always thrives in nature. Really? She's pretty good, yes. How beautiful, look! We kept going for one hour something and then we finally got to our destination. Uh, 
Do you like your state? Beautiful. <laughs> oh my god. Okay, this whole hike has been put on the jacket, take off the jacket. Hot, cold, hot, cold. Yeah. I'll have a snack. Mmm, no. It's cold. Ryan, I'm showing the camera that you're really good at skipping rocks. I feel like not a lot of people can do it. I mean, a lot of people, but not everybody. Three? Yeah. Okay, apparently everybody can do it except for me. Okay, now, I know it sounds weird, but I am more afraid of going down than going up and it's more difficult for me to go down because I always think that I will, you know, slip and fall back and hit my head. So, I'll see you later. I wouldn't drink it. I really don't think you should drink it. You don't know if it's drinkable. Unless you're really like dying, I wouldn't drink it. it. Smells perfectly clean. Yeah, but you don't know. At this point, there was nothing I could say to stop Brian from drinking that water. I told him that cows and squirrels and bats could poop in the river, but you know, he was thirsty. I even tried to get Jim to help me, but nothing worked. At least, he tasted it, but he didn't really drink it. So, I mean, that's a small victory. Okay, now that we are almost at the car, I can say it. I waited until the very last moment because, you know, I'm superstitious, but you saw all those people when we started hiking with like the huge backpacks and the shoes and all the rest. I mean, I don't think it was really necessary. I mean, two possibilities. It's either I am so good at hiking that I don't need it because I am so good. I can't really rule out this option, but I doubt it. Or maybe they did something different, like they didn't follow the path or something, or they're camping, they're staying overnight, I don't know. Okay, now I'm editing this and I'm sure that some hiking experts thinking, girl, you don't know what you were risking. And you would be right, hiking expert. We're going back to the car. I did it. It was really beautiful. If you come to Colorado, I actually really recommend coming to Colorado. back to our hotel and I am so sleepy so sleepy I woke up early today and tonight we're going out with some friends so I want to be fresh and rested and tonight I mean we are having dinner at 6 30 American time so I'd better take a shower now sleep for like 30 minutes get ready and go ready to go we'll take an uber no not uber lift lift to the restaurant and we'll have fun with some friends and i don't think i'm wait and i don't think i'm really really gonna vlog because it's always weird when someone vlogs but i think you can we're vlog everything except for the social moment i know yes because we're going to i think an italian restaurant because yeah. the restaurant's called il postino just Il post uh, postino. I think it's gonna be an Italian restaurant and I want to show you what I end up eating. Yes, I'll bring the little camera. This is so small, they won't even notice. I'm hungry. I'm hungry. That little nap, that 30 minute nap saved my life. Guys, I'm so stupid. I brought the camera but I forgot to vlog because I was enjoying the night and I just forgot. Anyways, it was a like an Italian inspired wine bar. So the main thing was wine and beer and then they had like some Italian sandwiches, they had bruschettas, 
Prosquete and stuff like that. It was really good. But the most important thing is that we spent time with Brian's friends and they're my friends now. And one cool thing is that I really get along with Brian's friends and he really gets along with my friends. I feel like it says so much about who we are and about our personalities so I love spending time with his friends as well. I'm so sad that we live so far but we had an amazing night and then we headed back to our hotel. Good morning people, I forgot to end the vlog yesterday so I recreated yesterday Sonia just to end the vlog. Scratch the vlog! Scratch the vlog, thank you so much for watching, bye bye.